What's up, guys? Hello, Kitty Slayer here, bringing you another Modern Warfare 3 Moab. This time on the out, uh, on the map outpost, and I got a little question for you guys. Um, as many of you guys who watched my yesterday's video, I had the funeral today, which was a lot harder than I thought it would be. Um, it took a little, it took a while, and I'm gonna admit it, dude. That's the first time I cried in public since God knows when. Well, first time I cried, period, because that was real hard to go through, especially during the funeral when the uh, the pastor, the guy, okay, my grandpa's church, the pastor, the guy who uh, talks up the church, went up there and started talking. That was real hard to deal with, you know, what uh, he said on Sunday. He died Monday. He, what, what he said on Sunday, especially the part that he said goodbye, that was just horrible to hear. I mean, that was real hard to go through. And um, But anyway, my question is, are you guys scared to die? I mean, when I'm, right now, as a 17-year-old person, I am terrified to die. Um, and, you know, going through funerals like that, I guess imagine if one of your parents died and you had to go through that, or your sibling, or, you know, someone really, really close to you, your best friend. That was my grandpa, but, I mean, like, if that was my, one of my parents, I don't know how I could handle that, you know? Um, and sometimes I think, you know, if I was dead, like, how people that are close to me would handle that, because I don't know if I could do it. That would be terrible. Like, especially... It's not as bad when you die of old age like he did. Well, he died of cancer, but he was, like, 82. But if you're young like me or, you know, like, just two years ago, a year ago, I had a friend who uh, died in a car wreck and, you know, just my age right now, about 17, 18 years old. And it was horrible, like, how to deal with that stuff, you know? But if you die of old age, it's a little bit easier to handle because, you know, you're in a better place now and all that. But if you die young, you know, if young, if you have cancer, that's just, I don't know. I don't know how people would handle it. Some people are just strong like that. And, you know, um, if you guys believe in God, which I do, so I'm going to talk about that, you know, sometimes it's better just to go into, you know, to go to Jesus instead of sitting there struggling on earth. You know, he lived a great life. And, you know, a lot of people respected him. And sometimes I wonder when I get, you know, when I'm older and, you know, if I ever die, you know, at the funeral, how many people will be there to support and, uh, you know, honor me? Like, because I remember when I was a little kid, this is the first time I've been to a funeral in years since I was probably like seven or eight. I didn't really understand what was going on back then. But now as a 17, almost 18 year old, it's a lot different and it's a lot more um, heartbreaking. You know, it's really hard to deal with sometimes. I don't know if I'm just a pussy or what, but when you care about someone, you know, even that wasn't even like. That was pretty much my stepdad's grandpa. That wasn't even, like, real blood. If my parents died or my sibling, I would be terrible. I would be devastated for days, weeks, months, years. Like, I don't know how I can handle that, honestly. Until they die of old age, then it's still very hard to deal with. But at least they're in a better place, you know? And I just don't understand how... God. You really, I really respect people who go through that because it's real hard to deal with. And if you guys ever been through a funeral and you're old enough to realize what's going on, you're not like ten or under, you know. It's it's real. Um, it puts life in perspective. Let me say it that way. And I definitely have a new appreciation for life. I'm gonna try to, you know, you know, just live life to the fullest. You only live once, right? Well, technically, if you believe in God, you uh, resurrect and you'll. Uh, live in heaven, you know, you, you'll have an eternal life, that's the word I'm looking for, damn, this commentary is almost wrapping up, anyway guys, I'm gonna just leave it there, um, just ask me, or leave it in the comment if you guys are scared to die, and what you believe, you know, I mean, that was just, it's real hard to go through, and it really puts life, you know, in perspective, but, um, anyway, enjoy the Moab guys, I think this is my second one I posted, t uh, today, uh, this time it's on the Outpost one, and I know it's with the ACR again, but oh well, I just wanted to to get it gold so anyway thanks for listening have a great day